This tune, Come Find Me, centres around this one chord with a descending bass line and a descending melody line as well. The chord itself, you'll find that you have to keep your fingers, these two fingers, up on their tips to keep the G ringing clearly. Otherwise you're going to get that sort of thing. So be careful that when you frame that chord that the G is free. Like that. The first obstacle you're likely to encounter is in bar 4, which is where you have to lay a bar chord at the second fret. I'll show you. You'll need to be ready to lay finger 1 on that bar immediately after the preceding chord, so... before you lay fingers 4 and 3 down to play the rest of the chord. The next point I want to mention occurs in bar 27 where it's not particularly difficult, but it does involve a stretch in a chord, and it's a stretch where you need to let an open string ring once again. So I'll just show you those two chords. I'll just show you that again dead slow. It's a bit of a stretch between the first and the fourth fingers, and once again you've got to make sure these two fingers keep well clear of the middle G, otherwise it won't ring. Um, as a little interesting point of music, you'll find that this chord here is the chord that we started from. It's just that you've got the A on the top of the chord this time, making it sound different. The only time you get bar chords cropping up in this piece is always at fret number 2. And in the transcription I've notated these with a capital C and the Roman numeral 2. This is standard in classical guitar transcriptions where C actually stands for bar. The only difference, or one of the differences anyway, is right at the end of the piece when you've got to put your second finger on the G, on the bass string, and it's a bit of a quick change, so I'll show you that one slowly too. And I'll show you that again dead slow. And that's about it for this transcription. Work through it slowly, don't rush through it, just do a few bars at a time. You'll find the way I've written it out is as straightforward as I can make it. There are no tricky repeat sections or anything like that. So if you've got any problems, then you can contact me through my website and I'll try and work things out for you. Um, but failing that, have fun and enjoy the, enjoy the piece. <laughs>